What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Darian. This is Jeremy, and we are D and J React. React. Um, this one's a new one. Yeah, I've never heard of these guys before, but a lot of people have been asking about them, begging people, us to do it for quite a while. People have been asking us for a long, long time to do dream catchers. Yeah. Um, we've just had so many requests that it's it's hard to get to all of them quick enough because we only do five videos a week. Yeah, guys, please be patient because we hear you in the comments and we know you guys want your songs played, but literally every day there's got to be at least 50 to 100 songs people are requesting. There's only so many we can get to. Yeah. Um, but this one is Dream Catchers, so I'm kind of excited to see what this is about. This is a new K-pop band that, we've, that we're doing today for the first time, so it's going to be interesting to jump into a new one. This one's uh, called Boca. I have no idea what this song is about. But uh, curious from to find I, out. From what I've seen, it's another girl band too, so it'd be kind of cool. Yeah. See another girl band, how they uh, play out. Yeah. Well, I think um, I was reading something that like their favorite color is black, and their theme of what they do is more dark. Oh, than really? The traditional female K-pop oh, okay. group. So uh, yeah, that might be that might be something we relate to. We're into rock. So. Yeah. I like the harder, heavier sounds anyway. So yeah. Hopefully that's what this is um let me just do something okay yeah let's get into it let's go about uh, a relationship I'm guessing yeah finding love that's what this is that's what Boca is about uh, I guess so guys leave a comment down below what does Boca mean I'm, uh, I'm a little confused what that hear about the darkness the clouds the thunder finding love hmm let's find out more <laughs> First K-pop band though that I've heard with guitar, like actual oh, yeah, like yeah, rock yeah. guitar and like drums in the background. Right, right, right. Am I right? Usually, it, like from what I've noticed in the other bands, it's like synthetic music. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah, I don't know. They're not not like real live bands, like you said. There's not like the drums and the guitar and the bass and keyboards and stuff. And this this kind of has a little bit of that in there. Yeah, I like it. Mm -hmm. So far, so good. <laughs> About the visuals i mean the video i love man i love all the visuals the costumes and stuff kind of like a uh, ninja type theme to yeah. it you know it's kind of cool definitely darker like they were describing yeah definitely I, I really like it a lot 
I'm just having a hard time like understanding lyrics, like where this song is going. I'm reading everything and it, I just, I'm not, not putting it together. I think it's about like a toxic relationship. Guys, let us know in the comment what Boca is about. Um, I think it's about a toxic relationship, but- um, Finding love? By that thorn-like phrase, I don't know. I'm, I'm assuming it's about a toxic relationship. Yeah, it could or, be. I don't know. But I keep uh, hearing the word finding love and then there's dark clouds, there's thunder. So might be yeah. relating to like a toxic relationship. Yeah. Usually that's not a bright, happy thing. <laughs> no, not at all. <laughs> um, but yeah, dude, love the drums. Like, yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah, man. I love the beats. I'm already like a fan of Dreamcatcher and I'm only two minutes in. Yeah. Dude, what does Boca mean? I was just gonna say that I'm interested in seeing what the terminology for Boca actually means to this song. When she said I'm... Boca, she like opened her hand like that. So yeah. I don't know if it's like a Dragon Ball Z reference. Or <laughs> Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> I don't know, man. I can't understand what Boca means. But uh, let us know down in the comments because it's driving me crazy. Yeah, but I mean the visuals of the video, mm -hmm. you know, and the effects and stuff were phenomenal. Dude, the editing that yeah. they had in here was loved like, it. crazy. Absolutely dude. love it. And her voice was amazing too. Beautiful yeah. voice. Really good group, man. Yeah. I'm, uh, I'm actually impressed. You know, some of the bands, when we first hear their first song, we're like, eh, yeah. okay. Yeah, it takes then, one or two songs to kind of get into it, but this was really cool. I like this. And then the people in the comments are like, no, just give it a little bit more time. Yeah. Like, keep doing them. Like, I think you'll you'll eventually like them. And that's how it was with BTS when we listened to yeah, them. Yeah, the first we're like, two nah. was kind of rough for us. That was a tough start, but now we're actually really enjoying them a lot. Yeah, like five, six songs in, we, we started to get right. really into them, and then we did the, the guide and everything, and yep. then got way, way more into them. Absolutely. But uh, first one, very first song, this was badass, dude. Yeah, I like this one a lot. I'm excited to see a lot more of their videos. I'm definitely going to be adding probably one of their songs in each week for probably the next three weeks, because I really want to see more of Dreamcatcher. Guys, let us know down in the comments more songs that you like personally from Dreamcatcher. I'd be interested uh, to do another reaction to them. But um, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like this content, like, subscribe, hit that bell notification for more. Jump over to Patreon, uh, click the sign up button, and uh, vote for the songs for the following week. Just posting your comment on YouTube isn't going to do it because we have people paying and Patreon voting on these songs. So the ones in YouTube, we aren't taking into consideration. Just the ones on our Patreon for the paying members. Correct. Those are the ones that only have power over the decisions of the videos that we do for the following week. Again, thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Peace.